today you are focused on being more disciplined and keeping your priorities in order you are in the energy of moving forward and going on the journey to a new timeline a new frequency in the near future you definitely need to watch about taking risks that are going to stop you from growing dealing with energies that are going to stop you from growing and moving forward overall there is a need to watch what you gamble on watch what you're putting your energy towards because there were some illusions and you may find yourself looking back on things and regret if you aren't careful so you want to make appropriate plans 1122 as i say that and watch what you're committing to it's also time to get organized on this path in this new season, you are no longer teaming up with people who are no longer in alignment with you. Things that aren't balanced, you're no longer going to be a part of those. It may have been a mystery before, but it's no longer a mystery who you should be working with. Now is also a time where you aren't fighting to keep your finances in order. You are more or less um, working towards things that are going to allow you to be at peace and to create. You are going to have to masterfully create this life, this frequency that you want. Again, nobody is going to just hand you these things. In terms of what you should be walking away from, um, and that's being at battle, being at war with others as well as yourself, there's no longer any need to fight. You have grown past these things, and you need to believe that you are able to have this new beginning. You're able to have this new start. In the near future, there may be an instance of you need so there's an air of you working hard to attain this goal and that's going to be the rebirth and the transformation. So continue to work towards your rebirth and your transformation. Um, strong um, Scorpio energy here. So continue to do the continue to work towards your newer, higher self and you're going to be doing it. Um, in her memo, you know, everybody don't need to know everything, but it's time for you to get in the field and do the work. It's time for you to get organized. It's time for you to commit it, Virgo energy. So, Spirit saying, yo, use this Capricorn energy to your benefit because this new moon is coming and she's waiting for you to embrace this brand new change that is going to be taking effect, whether you like it or not. What side of the street or the table will you be sitting or standing on? 11.33 as I say that. If there was any particular moment you may have been having some blockages that were stopping you from moving forward, it is time for you to get fearless. It is time for you to build your strength in who you are trying to be. You know, you might not be feeling as confident, but it's time for you to get that way. It's time for you to get sure of yourself. And it's um, also time for you to, again move away from things that don't allow you to operate as your own like creative being things and people and places that are trying to tell you who you should be why you should be what you should be now it's not the time for that um you already know what you need to know and what you don't know it's time for you to be um, thorough about communicating with your spirit guys and communicating with spirit and your ancestors to make it through you might feel like you trapped, but you're really not. Like, again, like I said earlier, your wisdom has grown. You know better now so you can do better. The idea that you are not going to make calculated risk that are going to benefit you that's a thing of the past you are continuing to kind of assess things that you know maybe missed you up in the past that caused you to be in delusion that caused you to not have clear sight but again there's no longer something that you are worried or plagued with you know there the people there are hiding their face from you and pretending that they are rocking with you when they're not you know obviously you see those things like i said earlier you have the mouse tools now to be able to see through the veil and also the veil is thinning anyway period but yeah you're gonna have the peace that you are needing to create you are gonna have what you are searching for you know there's no need to continue 
your lack of confidence and belief in yourself is what's holding you back any particular like negative thoughts anything that is keeping you in a cycle it's really all in your head at this point and those are the things you need to move around move away from there also might be some partnerships and collaborations that you want to lay to rest at this particular time yeah so you can find balance and stability once you find um once you're able to get the confidence to walk away from these like energies um in other people as well as in yourself because you know it's all about projection you'll be fine but you need to get assertive you need to get confident you need to get brave and that's what this is all about Aquarius energy here it's time for you to be a leader and a visionary and that's what's going to release your stagnation that's what's going to propel you into the higher timeline that you are looking for not what society is looking for what brings you fulfillment but you being stuck with this mother of sticks energy um and it's kind of like that's where you need to find balance you know don't be pessimistic don't be thinking like oh it can't go well you don't have the passion to move forward but there are people places and things that you're gonna have to lay and there could be a fire sign feminine involved here or masculine in their feminine energy that you are no longer dealing with or collaborating with yeah spirit is saying continue to move away and fight those energies out of your way because your table is being prepared in the face of your enemies and you're not using your intuition and not being patient and not being methodical is going to hinder you you are the empress you are the leader aries so yeah that's what it is y'all so wherever you might be lacking strength in this particular timeline, Spirit is asking you to set up a proper foundation, get ready to move in your King of Pentacles energy so that you can grow and become who you're trying to be. Now is not the time to deal with things that you should have been laid to rest and things that affect your confidence. It's time for you to play your cards right. You also need to realize things that are keeping you trapped in a way from the coming into your Queen of Pentacles energy. And that's just your nurturing side. That's just your caring about you side. If you're not good, no one's good. Spirit's asking you to use your wisdom and from previous timelines to set yourself up from the future. Now is not the time to be self-destructive with this father of baskets on the bottom you want to be working towards things that again are in alignment give you security and allow you to be a leader and focused on yourself as well as the community and setting down um something that you can be proud of moving forward so yeah y'all if you would like a private reading definitely hit me up